Hello boys and girls and welcome back to another video and this will be a FIFA 22 news video and without further ado really let's just get into it show you what's up. So first of all you can see a FIFA account known as a FIFA Witcher who's semi reliable for rumours and stuff. Um, he's posted that a fiscal report demonstrates that FIFA 22 launch will be in the same period as last year and I think that's the period it was meant to be released in. So there shouldn't be any delays on this um, FIFA 22's uh, release date, which is good news. It should be around end of September, I'd imagine. And from the release date to some news date, EA Sports, the official account, had tweeted out, EA Play is coming back on July the 22nd. So we may get some news before this, but the official news will probably be the 22nd, the earliest we'll get it. So you can look forward to that and hope for the best. Next news story now. And as you can see here, AEK Athens has um, tweeted out in Greek that high EA Sports. Uh, see, I can't speak it's a little Greek. Um, but basically, translated, what it means is that AEK Athens has signed an exclusive deal with EA and is asking to hire people that have the knowledge of the Greek league football. So, with that in mind, what's basically insinuating is will a Greek league become to FIFA 22? Because look, at the moment we have the rest of the world. I think it's like. Athens, Olympiakos, Panathinaikos and maybe a few others but this will be the full uh, Greek league and this, this will be interesting so let me know what you think in the comments and yeah I'll be excited for this one to do a few career modes in the Greek league that would be nice now moving into the penultimate story and this is a uh, Langpard Leaks team of the season this is a foot account obviously and what they're saying is in FIFA 22 weekend league will no longer be 30 games and it will be less apparently see no confirmation as of yet but these are just rumours in this news video as well as confirmed things. So, uh, I don't play foot that much and I'm not too interested on how long the weekend league is. But uh, let me know if that's a big thing for you because I know people when it was 40 struggled to get through all of them. And 30 is a bit better but apparently it's still not the easiest to get through. And maybe 20, 25, would that be ideal? Let me know in the comments what the ideal weekend league matches would be. And yeah, move into the final story now. Now finally, not a story as much, but a few FIFA 22 potential covers uh, done by uh, F underscore edits on Twitter. And I'm just going to run through a few of these and tell me which ones you prefer. Obviously in the previous one we had the Ronaldo one on the left and the Messi and Ansu Fati one on the right. But now moving on to Manchester United, we've got Bruno Fernandes and we've got Mason Greenwood. And these two are tasty. I think uh, yeah, Bruno has more of a chance of being on the cover, but we'll see. Moving into the next one now. Moving on to Chelsea boys now, we've got Reese James on the left and Marnie Mace on the right and uh, these look really cool to be fair. Um, not much to be said, let's move on to the next ones. <laughs> Moving on to the last set and these two I think, Erling Brat Holland and Hey Jude on the right. Um, yeah, I think these two are the most likely to be on the cover of FIFA 22 actually and I think them, well, them along with Bruno, I think them three have a really good chance. I'd be surprised if it's anyone else to be honest. Um, but yeah, that, that brings the conclusion to this video. Let me know if you want more of these. Um, I'll try, do one every week, see what else comes up and yeah, keep you informed. Have a, have a good day.